Well, AD uh, certainly one of the team's best wins in a long time, uh, and certainly this season, and the way that you performed individually, and Milwaukee's still up to the task. Uh, what did it take tonight, and what do you think was the difference? Uh, team effort. Um, you know, we, we've played for a full 48 minutes tonight, competing, um, you know, taking punches, and they come on the third, and I don't know how many threes they hit, but we would uh, withstand, withstood their run um, and just executed. You know, this is a good win for us. Obviously, you, you know, we feel like our first game, the first game and the last game on a long road trip are the most important. Um, obviously, each game is important, but starting the road trip off right, um, and then that last game, you know, you know, after a long trip, you kind of ready to get back home, so that's important too. But uh, we want to come out and, and set a tone for our road trip, you know, against a, a great team, one of the top teams in the league, um, and we was able to get a victory tonight. Since I know you're going to bring it up, are, are you going to give some credit to Aaron Rodgers? Absolutely, <laughs> absolutely. <laughs> Even though it's here in Wisconsin. <laughs> yeah, um, I mean, you guys know how I feel about the pack and him. So, um, seeing him before the game, you like, hey, man, I, I need 30 tonight. And uh, I just saw him. He said, I only said 30, not 40. So, <laughs> uh, you know, so uh, it's always good to, you know, for him to come out and, and you know, Watch, watch the Lakers play, watch me play. And, um, you know, he's a fan just how, you know, I'm a fan of his. So, and my guy Randall was there too. So it was, it was good to see some pack in the house uh, and, and get the win for them. Hi. AD, um, you know, throughout this run you've had, you've done a lot of your damage in the paint, but your, your jump shot was working today, two threes. Saw the step back fade away at the end of the first. What, when did that feel like? That was in your bag tonight, and what's your confidence in your jump shot right now? I'm always confident in every shot that I take. Um, just knowing how they play, you know, Brooke being down the floor, Giannis being down the floor, um, it wasn't probably going to be a, you know, get to the rim game. So just trying to shoot over the top. Um, and then after you make a couple, then they starting to close out and you're able to get to the paint. So I'm um, just trying to make the reads and be confident in, my, in, in, in every shot that I take. Uh, you know, I rep it a lot uh, on practice, off days, whatever, in the gym, getting a shot. So um, just staying confident and, and, and just letting it fly. Eddie, hey, understanding that <clears throat> it's, it was one night tonight, but um, you, Russ, and LeBron as a unit has been under a, a fair amount of scrutiny since it was formed. Mm -hmm. How did that function tonight? And... How replicable do you think? I mean, obviously, it's not going to be exactly like this every night, but what, yeah. what does this say about that core potentially moving forward? Um, we're figuring it out game by game, day by day. Uh, we're in constant communication about how we can get better uh, late game, throughout the game. Um, you know, the play that, you know, says for us, Lakers basketball is rushed out on the floor after uh, a pass that Chris Middleton fumbled um, and then getting us – Kind of, sort of, you know, a, a, a ceiling dunk, you know, kicking it to Braun and then, you know, Braun passing it to me. So, um, you know, we're just figuring it out um, with us three Russ, you know, making some great reads, making some good play calls, and we're just trying to execute. But, uh, you know, he did a good job tonight, Braun, myself, uh, the rest of the guys. So we're, we're just trying to, you know, figure it out and just let the outside noise be outside noise and, um, you know, try to keep stacking wins. AD, some of these games on the calendar mean more to an individual in the group uh, for whatever reason in their background. Tonight you come back to Milwaukee where Darwin had been an assistant for a long time. How much was that on the minds of the players? And, and he told us that, hey, he may have given more in the scout than he normally would have because he has some institutional yeah. knowledge of this team. Um, I mean, it's like a player going back home. I mean, going back to his previous team for the first time, uh, you know, as a head coach, you know, it's that first win and then going back to your former team. And I think, uh, you know, this one, without it being said before the game, you know, we want to win it for him, obviously, you know, saying that we only come here once a year, uh, once a season. Uh, so he wants to get that, you know, you know, that victory for him. Um, and it, I mean, it, it feels good. I mean, it feels good when, you know, your coach is doing everything for your players, for the players to, you know, to try to put them in the right position to get victories. And then we can also return a favor and, you know, get this win here back home for them. Last question. Hey, you and Giannis had a bit of a duel tonight and it's his 10th season now. I'm curious, what do you remember from playing? Okay. Yeah. Oh. Um, what do you remember? Like, what do you remember playing against him like very early in his career? And how have you seen him, him change to where he is now? Um, it's funny because anytime you know we line up, I try to think about 
you know, previous matchups and how I can be better. And, uh, you know, obviously his usage rate wasn't as high early on, you know, coming in, you know, uh, as a young player. Um, but he's continued to grow over over the years <clears throat> to become, you know, two-time MVP, dominant player. So uh, hats off to him, respect. And uh, it's always a battle. I mean, you know, uh, we bring the best out of each other. You know, it's, it's a fun matchup. Um, you know, even though we probably don't guard each other a lot um, in the game, um, we're both trying to do everything possible to help the team win. So uh, it's always a good matchup, you know, anytime we step on the floor together. Thanks, man. Go. Go, Pat, go.